Well, let's move now to the first week of December. It will feel a bit colder than we've been used to, at least the last couple of days, but it seemed like we were a little bit more unseasonably warm for our Thanksgiving and everything else. I could be wrong. Yeah, we were spoiled a little bit. Now we're kind of crashing back down to reality, unfortunately. But we do have a nice day shaping up for tomorrow, probably the warmest day of the week before some big changes for midweek. So I want to take a peek at the upcoming week ahead. Clear and cold tonight. You know, there's really no beating around that. It is going to be frosty out there tonight, so you'll need an extra blanket on the bed. We will rebound quite nicely for tomorrow. That should be the warmest day of the week. And then we're watching for a storm system by midweek that could bring us some precipitation, several forms of precipitation. If you're wondering about some of that cold weather, it's kind of right over us here, stretching all the way from the Missouri and Red River Valley all the way down into our area. And it is chilly, so we'll zoom it in for a closer look at our neighborhood and you can see across northwest Arkansas everybody in the uh, upper to mid 30s right now. Rogers and Bella Vista already flirting with the freezing mark. Meanwhile, just a little bit warmer in the River Valley. You're more in the upper 30s uh, still Boonville hanging on to the lower 40s. We talked about that storm system. Here it is. It'll, we have this timed out. This is starting tomorrow night at 7 o'clock because between then and now really nothing will happen. This storm system will continue to move our way and intensify. Looks right now that the second half of Wednesday is when we'll see the best chance for widespread showers to develop. But we're also watching as this system moves by, it will be pulling in colder air. And within some of those showers, there might be a couple of wet snowflakes, mostly across northwest Arkansas. I think the River Valley will remain all rain. Calm winds tonight, not a bad night out there. You can see it'll be cold though with those lows in the lower to mid 20s out there. Here's a look at lows for your neighborhood tonight. Again, most everybody stuck in the 20s, a pretty chilly night out there, but we will rebound into the mid to upper 50s tomorrow with plenty of sunshine and warmer temperatures. As I said, the warmest day of the week, your extended forecast for Northwest Arkansas. We're making uh, an impact day Wednesday as well as Thursday, mostly for the, the rain with a little bit of wet snow mixed in there, and then we rebound for the rest of the week. Not too bad with temperatures warming up to more seasonable levels. Meanwhile, in the River Valley, about the same thing, except leaving out the chance for a few wet snowflakes Wednesday night and into Thursday. I think it will remain all rain with sunshine coming back on the heels of that and warmer temperatures by the time we get toward the weekend. If you were with us Friday, you saw we forecasted a high of 56 degrees for Gravit. Just got there, just made it by four degrees. So congratulations to Clark Gray of Clarksville. Ironic there. He is the winner of the umbrella. Tomorrow we're forecasting a high of 54 for the Chester area. Stay tuned. Jordan is up after the break with sports.